Car detailing is pretty much a deep cleaning of a vehicle. We clean the nooks and crannies, the cracks and crevices, all the little details that you wouldn't normally get at a normal typical car wash. What I like about car detailing is the ability to transform a vehicle from very dirty to very clean. I would say that is the best part of my job, yeah. Oh, is it hot out here? My name is Randy Roblero. I'm 22 years old. I have a car detailing business. I make over $77,000 a year and I live in West Palm Beach, Florida. My parents immigrated from Guatemala in the late 80s. Growing up, even though we were living on a paycheck to paycheck basis, I feel like I didn't miss out on anything. My parents provided a roof over our heads, food on the table, and I was very satisfied with it. My father had a cardiac arrest in 2021. He ended up being in the hospital for seven months before we actually let him go. He was a smart person. He was a funny person, like very charismatic, and I miss him. When my father passed away, we took a huge financial hit. My mother had to start working again. My brother had to start working overtime at his job. We all came together to provide financial stability for the family. My father used to be a handyman. My brother is currently a customer service representative. And my mother works as a prep cook in a restaurant. And as for me and my car detailing business, I had to work more than I ever had in the past. I did go to college for two semesters. And after two semesters, I dropped out. I am more of a hands-on type of person. I just don't like listening to people in classrooms. It's just boring to me. So one day after high school, I went home and to my surprise, my father had gifted me a Nissan Altima. It was an older vehicle and it was in pretty rough condition. I started cleaning that vehicle from that day forward and I kept it very clean, very meticulous. The idea of car detailing just arose in me. My father saw me, you know, getting into the car detailing business and he came up to me and he said, Randy, I like what you're doing. And those words just stuck with me forever. I chose car detailing just because it is much easier to get into, especially at a young age compared to different type of businesses. I learned how to master car detailing by watching car detailing tutorials up on YouTube. This is my van with my mobile car detailing setup in it. Here I have a generator, I have my shop vacuum, I have my pressure washer hose as well as the hose reel, an air compressor as well as a 100 gallon water tank and here I have my car detailing cleaning products. Here is the rest of my setup inside of my van. Here's the bin with all of my microfiber towels. Here are my car detailing products and chemicals inside sprayer bottles, as well as my wheel cleaning bucket and a step ladder. My detailing van cost me $8,000. Everything I have inside of the van, whether it's tools, products, or equipment, cost me about $2,500. A total of $10,500 for my entire mobile car detailing setup. From my car detailing business, I make about $6,500 a month. I pay myself about $3,200 a month. Because I live with my family, I don't have a lot of expenses. I currently live in a four bedroom, two bathroom apartment and I split the rent with my brother. We pay $1,000 each. I pitch in $150 on a monthly basis for groceries and my family covers the rest. I have a girlfriend, her name is Anna. I've been with her for six years now and I like to take her out on a monthly basis. I spend around $400 on entertainment as well as restaurants. For my personal vehicle, the Mustang, I spend around $80 a month for insurance as well as $150 a month for gas. I spend about $500 as a business expense on a monthly basis and that is just buying car detailing products. For business insurance, I pay $107 on a monthly basis as well as my car insurance, I pay around $80 every month. I love my car detailing business because it's rewarding, it brings in money and it provides for my family. I do plan on doing car detailing for the rest of my life. Yeah, Tuesday morning works for me. Okay, yeah, that should be no problem. We do we do service that area. So we do have a water tank and provide our own uh, generator, so. My car detailing packages start at a rate of $120 for a normal sedan, and they can go up to all the way to $350 for a full detail. This car hasn't been cleaned in a while, so these couple holders are very nasty. Our detailing appointments can take anywhere between an hour and a half up to four hours, depending on the size and condition of a vehicle. It's pretty good to start a car detailing business in West Palm Beach just because there's so many cars. Every corner you turn, there's so many cars, all different sizes, types of vehicles, and there's just so much business, so much potential that you can make money from. Hey, my name is George. I've known Randy my whole life. 
Randy's my best friend and I usually come help him out whenever he needs a hand. It can get very hot out here, so you definitely want to drink water to avoid dehydrating. The heat is a big factor when I'm working. I could detail up to 20 cars a day, but just because of the heat, we limited four cars per day. Yeah. So we pretty much all finished, but I want to check it out, make sure it's good. I like it. Looks brand new. Yep. Yeah. Uh, 400? All right. 400. Thank you. Thank sure. you, man. All right, you know, whenever you need to clean, hit me up. I'm yes, over from there. All right, man. Thank, Thank you again. Thank you. In the future, I'm hoping to expand my business throughout Florida, hire more people, add more vans, and expand my clientele. In the future, I wanna make enough money so my mom doesn't have to work, and I want my family to be more financially stable than it is today. I just had the mentality, you know, that life goes on and, you know, you have to keep going on with your life, and I know that my father would've wanted me just, you know, to, to, to do that instead of, you know, um, just mourning his loss every day in my life. Every time I came from work, he would always just remind me, he would say things like, uh, you know, you want to work for yourself in the future, you know, you want to do your own thing, you know, you're from here, you're, you're in America, you know, you, you, act, you have the ability to do so. You know, whether it's the smallest thing or not, you can achieve things that, you know, me as an immigrant can't do.